Hey guys, another video here from HoustonJailbreak.com. Uh, in this video, we'll be continuing to show the new features in the iOS 5 or version 5.0. Um, now, the feature that I'm about to show you is a really neat feature. It was nowhere to be found in any other previous versions. Apple finally implemented this feature into the iOS. Uh, it has to do with the photos, editing your photos. Before, you just take a picture and it's saved in your camera roll and that's it. There was no way to edit it. Now, if you open up your photo app, just go to your camera roll, click on one of your photos, you'll notice an edit button in the top right corner. That was not there before in the previous versions. So we'll go ahead and tap that and then you'll see four options at the bottom. Now I'll go ahead and go through these just so you can see uh, exactly what they do. The bottom left button is the rotate button. Tap that, it's going to rotate your photo if you need it upside down, sideways, however you'd like to have it. The next button is the auto enhance button. Now this really only applies if you're taking a photo and you're not satisfied with the way it came out, it's not as bright as you want it, you would tap that button. I could hit it now but it wouldn't make any changes to this photo because it's already a pretty clear picture. The third button is if you've taken a photo of a person, friend or family and their eyes just happen to be red in the photo, you'll be able to remove that red eye with this button right here. Uh, the final option is the crop button. Tap that there. You might want to crop out a vehicle or a car or there might be only part of this part of the picture that you'd like to save. With this, it'll let you crop out exactly what you need. Just place it like that, and you would click crop in the top right corner. Now I'm not going to change this photo at all, so I'm just going to click cancel. But again, it's very easy. Just go to one of the photos that you've taken. Tap edit in the top right button and then you'll see these four options at the bottom. Remember to press save once you've made any changes so that the changes will be saved in your photo. Once again that's another great feature that can be found in iOS 5 or version 5.0. Uh, for Follow us on Twitter, like our Facebook page, uh, if you enjoyed our videos, please subscribe, comment, and rate. Uh, for any more information or if you'd like to get in contact with us locally, visit HoustonJailbreak.com.